Welcome back. Olivia Newton-John, Queen and John Farnham are just some of the big name stars set to light up the stage for our country's firefighters. In less than a month's time, the 70,000 seats in Sydney's ANZ Stadium will be filled with concert goers, raising money for those affected by the fires. Yeah, it's, it's a tremendous lineup. but we're really, really super excited about the, the length and breadth both internationally and, uh, and Australian stars. There's been an enormous outpouring of donations and generosity from people and we're just doing our little bit uh, the same as everybody else. Tickets went on sale today but they won't be available for long. And now here's Mike with the seven day forecast. Yeah, thank you, Jen. Good evening once again on what's been a very hazy old day today. Visibility in Melbourne down to five kilometres. Similar sort of weather tomorrow and then a wet old Wednesday, possibly th thunderstorms Wednesday afternoon and cooling right down on Thursday. OK, a couple of great photos now that have been sent to Mike's Picks at network10.com.au. And first up from Tracy, a bird's eye view of Bayswater and a smoke filtered sun in the big bird in the front. Uh, further afield, this perspective from Karen of Emu Creek Road. So 30 degrees was the overnight low, way above average this afternoon. We got to around 30 degrees by three, then we stuck up to 32 degrees a little while ago. Still very warm outside. If you catch up with friends, fabulous sort of weather. Temperature on 30 degrees, the humidity at 30 percent and the wind northerly blowing at just seven kilometres per hour. Around Melbourne today, have a look at some of those numbers there and that's why a lot of you wanted to wear short sleeves or short shirts and things like that today or even short skirts for my brother across our state. Uh, smoke returned to blanket uh, pretty much all of our state. Northerly is pushing temperatures way above average. Generally two to five degrees up on the norm. In the east though it was closer to normal. 36 degrees the max in the northeast. The lowest maximum not surprisingly in the Alps where it was 17 degrees at Mount Hotham. Around the country it's been soggy in Sydney. 26 degrees up in Brisbane 29. Uh, Canberra 27. Uh, Perth 33. Adelaide a degree warmer. Interstate tomorrow a heap of rain is on the way for WA due to tropical cyclone Claudia. Meanwhile, another scorcher in Adelaide, 19 to 34. Hobart back to 23 tomorrow, then 14, uh, 23, 30 on Wednesday. Sydney, 27 degrees. A lot of rain up there on Friday and Saturday. Uh, Brisbane, a scrap warmer and stormy. Canberra, 33 the next couple of days. Closer to home, moving into Victoria. Patchy morning fog in the south. Dry and mostly sunny also in the south. Up in the northeast and northwest and central ranges, showers and thunderstorms look like developing, mostly in the northwest. Still some smoke haze in central and eastern Victoria. It's going to be very hot, close to 40 in the Mallee, uh, 37 for Bendigo, Shepparton and Wangaratta, Aubrey 36. Good rain for East Victoria on Thursday. A strong wind morning tomorrow for the East Gippsland coast. Around Melbourne, cloud building in the afternoon tomorrow in the outer northern suburbs, possibly triggering a shower or thunderstorm. Have a look at those numbers, still very warm tomorrow. Frankston 33, uh, Mount D even 13 to 30 in the Yarra Valley 14 to 34. And on the bays we'll have west southwesterly winds at 15 knots. They will tend south westerly and then back to west southwesterly waves as usual about a meter the sun rising at 12 past six setting at quarter to nine so for melbourne catch up with friends as i mentioned a great night not cooling down at all this evening tomorrow an 18 degree start to a 29 degree afternoon smoky patchy fog and out of suburbs in the early hours so 18 to 29 tomorrow on the wednesday hot and humid 21 to 31 partly cloudy the smoke haze clearing as the day progresses as winds shift south southwesterly a 70 percent chance of showers later in the day into the night. Two to eight millimetres of rain likely, possibly more in some eastern suburbs. Thursday, much cooler, 16 to 29. Cloudy, not smoky, possibly an early morning shower. Friday, cloudy, 15 to 24. And the all-important weekend, Saturday, 17 to 27, partly cloudy, a 40% chance of an afternoon shower. And then Sunday, 24 degrees and showery, up to five millimetres of rain likely on Sunday. So that is your forecast. It's been a smoky, hazy old day today. Same again tomorrow, just a couple of degrees cooler. See you tomorrow night. Jen? Thank you, Mike. And that's 10 News First for this Monday. I'll have updates throughout the evening. Stay with us now for the project from the team. Good night.